Hi everyone, my name is Melvin Gelbart and today I'm going to be showing you one of the new features of the Omero extension in QPath. So first, um, regardless of the task, we usually recommend creating a new project. So that's why I've prepared here an empty directory that I'm going to drop onto the QPath, uh, the main viewer of QPath. Click yes and create an empty project. So um, the main feature of of Omero of the new Omero extension is a browser. So the browser is accessible through extension Omero browse server new server, and then here you can input your um, the URL of the Omero server you'd like to browse. Um, I've taken here uh, the IDR as an example, so that's a public server. But obviously, it also works with private servers. So you click OK, and through the Omero JSON API, QPath will fetch all the information and display it quite nicely here in this window. So you can um, you can browse all the projects that you have, the data sets that you have, click on, on, um, on the different images that you have. Every time you'll get the information um, relating to the, to the image selected on the right side, as well as the thumbnail here. You can filter project names, you can um, also filter them by groups or by owners. And if you want to import these images into your project and further analyze them, um, in QPath, you can simply select them, click Import Selected, take the, the relevant boxes here, click Import, and in a couple of seconds, it'll just import them right uh, directly into your project. You can then open them and zoom in, zoom out. Um, also, create annotations, for instance, here, use a one tool. Um, you can also send them back to uh, to you the Omero server with the with the, the right command um, and do all types of analysis. Obviously once this is done, QPath will always remember the servers that you've browsed in the past. So like if you just want to add a few more images or just get more information, you can simply go to extension Omero browse server and your previous server will be there already. So this is obviously one of the many features that are included in the Omero extension. So um, if you want to find out more, you can obviously check out the documentation uh, and just explore it yourself a bit, you know, 